I'll be sharing to you about how I edit my intros and outros on my videos on my YouTube channel. Hi guys, it's me again, MJ, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new on this channel, please don't forget to hit the like and share and subscribe my channel. And please hit the notification bell so that every time when I have new upload, you will be notified. So for today's video guys, I'll be sharing to you on how I edit my intros and outros on my YouTube videos. I will show you how and please keep on watching. I'm using my Android mobile phone and let's go to our KineMaster, open it and click the landscape, click the media and then click the background. We need to choose the background, we will choose the color black. Extend the duration of the background and then change the color with blue. After I change the color, I prefer to put the background music first before I will put the images and the text of my video. So you need to choose the background music for your intro. After you add the music, you can listen to it and if you think that the music is too long for your intro, then you need to cut it according to how long your video will be. And then just adjust the background of the video the same as the background music duration. It must be in the same duration. Now we will start to put the image of our video. Click the layer and go to the media and choose the image that you wanted to use on your video. Click the image and then just drag it to the place where you wanted to put your image. And then put an in animation on your image and then choose whatever you want and then adjust the duration of your image. Let's go to another image, we'll open the overlay and click the springtime and then click the butterflies. As you notice in my intro, there are butterflies so I get it from there and then just drag it in the place where you wanted to put it. And then adjust the duration of it. This time, I will add the text of the video. So we'll just click the layer and then click the text. Write the text that you wanted to write. In here, I will put welcome to my channel. So we will put the text one by one so that later on we can adjust it according to the sequence on how they appear on your video. After you put all the text, you adjust it one by one according to the sequence and the duration of your text. You can do it by clicking the text and adjust it one by one by dragging it. After you adjust the text, now it's time for us to change the font. Just click the letter A and then click Latin and choose Redrest and the font of your text will change. Just do the same to all the text that you make. And also don't forget to adjust the size and also the distance of each text from each other. So you have to see to it that the distances of all the text are balanced and in the right place also. After you change all the fonts of your text, then you can also put some colors of your text if you wanted to. Just like what I did, I changed my M check into green. And after that, don't forget to adjust every text. To finish my intro video, we will put the last overlay which is the cherry petal burst. Click the layer and then click overlay and then choose the cherry petal burst and it will appear into your screen. You just drag it. Make sure that it will be in the right place where you wanted to put it. Try to play the video and check if it's in the right place where you wanted to put. After you put everything, then try to play it from the beginning and see to it that everything is okay. And if you're done, click export to save it. Next, I will show you on how I make my outro. We will add a background for a space and another background for our outro video. The color of the background of my outro video is white so we don't need to change the color. 
after you adjust the background duration then go to your audio and then choose the music or the background music that you are going to use on your outro do the same on what we did on our intro video cut the music if it's too long and then adjust the duration of both background and the background music so now we can start to put all the images that you wanted to put on your outro video so just follow what i did just open the layer and then if you wanted to put the overlay open the overlay and then if you want to add the image then just go to the media and then go to your gallery and just adjust it according to what you want and also remember to put an animation in animation or out animation if you wanted to and then check everything if it's okay or not and don't forget to adjust all the duration of the images that you are going to put on your video so that you will see when are they going to appear or when are they going to vanish after you make all the images then we need to proceed to make our text the text that will appear on my outro video will be my channel name the mc and also i will add thanks for watching and then i just add an overall animation on both text the mc and the thanks for watching and i choose the pulse overall animation and after you put everything then try to play it again and then try to see if it's okay or not if you're done making your outro then click the export and it will be saved on your mobile phone so this is now my created intro and outro videos So that's all for today's video guys. I hope you learned something and I hope you can apply it also on your YouTube videos. Thank you for watching and if you learned something, please don't forget to hit the like and share and subscribe my channel. And please hit the notification bell so that every time when I have new upload, you will be notified. And as I always say guys, don't forget to live a life to the fullest and be happy always. And God bless us all. See you next time on my next video. Bye!